Hello friends, I am Mudasir and you are watching my YouTube channel Shirazi Tech. Friends, in today's video I will show you how we turn on the function of saving auto points in our GPS because I also had to work and my points were not visible in the auto point save function. So I thought I'd share it with you friends and also turn it on from here with my controller. Now let's navigate to the screen of our controller and take a look at where we have the option to power it on. Yes, so now we have arrived at our controller screen, so here we will first go to go to work and then to survey. After going to survey, as you can see, there are four options showing up here, out of which the auto point option is not there. So what will we do now? This is the function button below. We will press this. As we press this, you can see here that now the configuration option has appeared, so we will click on it. After clicking, as you can see, the second option that is coming up here, we're looking at the auto point feature, so let's go ahead and click on it right here. As soon as we do that, you'll notice that the words log auto point appear on the screen. So we're going to click on that option as well. Once you've clicked, you can see that a tick mark has now appeared, indicating that the option has been selected. Additionally, you'll observe that several other options have become visible below. At this point, we're going to proceed and confirm our selection by clicking OK. After OK, we will go back once. Again, we will go to go to work. Then we'll select the survey option and following that as you can currently observe the auto option has now become available on the screen. For the subsequent settings adjustments we will once again press the function button. After that we will click again on the configuration. Firstly we have the option labeled auto points and following that as you can clearly observe there's a section titled store points by time. In this particular section you're presented with the opportunity to choose the preferred method or type for accumulating points. Now, for the purpose of this demonstration, I'm going to select the distance option. As we click on it, you can see what option is coming below. Time is coming first, the second is distance, there is height difference, and below that is distance and height. Whatever you want to set, you can select. So I am doing distance here, so as soon as I do distance, it auto selects here. 10 meters, so I will keep it at 10 meters because I have to take every 10 meters. But if you want to change it to 20 here, you can also make it 20 from here. I will take it from here and turn things back around. Below that is store, there are points and code and after that if you want to leave it as default that is also fine. Here you can see that the beep option is coming whether you want to do it here or not. So here it is never. So I will leave it as never and then I will OK it from here. Upon granting approval immediately following my click on the start button here we will initiate our survey in alignment with the predetermined automatic survey points and thereafter we can commence with our tasks. Whether you prefer to take it on foot or choose to travel in a vehicle, you have the freedom to take it in whichever way you wish. So that was it. I hope you liked today's video. If you liked the video, please like it, share it and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much.